Hi guys, this is just a video showing you some of my orchids that are either in bloom or about to bloom. This is a Vanda mix. Uh, I think it's a Vanda Tub Tim Velvet and Ask Cassandra something cross, but um, it had two flowers last year and now it has three so that made me happy because it bloomed very quickly the last time it bloomed was I think like four or five months ago and <clears throat> I live in Canada so it's hard to get light for them but I am so happy that it bloomed again so this is one of my favorite orchids it's really cool its root system is insane though and on to the next orchid. This is some sort of Oncidium cross. I don't know what it is, but this is uh, my oldest Oncidium. This keeps blooming. It is slightly fragrant. And it has another spike coming up there. It kind of got stuck, but it's free now. I freed it with a toothpick. Yeah, I like that one. It's kind of got like a floral scent to it. I have no idea what kind it is though. And then this one, I am very happy about this, is an enormous Cattleya. Um, and again, I have lost the tag, so I don't know exactly what it is. Uh, but yeah, it had two buds and they uh, developed very quickly into whatever this is now. Uh, I think it's like a BLC cross or like an LC or something like that. So it's awesome and it smells really good. Uh, the older it gets, the better it smells. So oh, it's pretty big, pretty big flower. Well, it's a shame that they don't last as long as Phalaenopsis or other orchids, but they are beautiful. And the next orchid is, you might recognize this one, it's an Oncidium Sherry Baby, and usually blooms a lot more than this, but oh well, yeah, it's in bloom right now. Absolutely love the smell on this, it smells so good. It's like a vanilla or chocolate or something. It looks better from that angle. Yeah. I am very happy I got this orchid. It's very nice. It needs to be repotted though. I just don't want to do it while it's in spike. And then this orchid is not in bloom yet, but it's got buds. So yeah, right there. And on a dried sheath right there. That one's cute. That one, I actually have a tag for it, is a Young Min Orange Golden Satisfaction. So That's cool. And this one is not in bloom right now, but this is my Kylochista exuperi, and this one has, let me see if I can find it, a spike, right there, the thing that is not a root coming out of it is a spike, so that makes me happy because these ones are supposed to be really hard to grow, let alone spike. So yeah. And I love the flowers on this and they smell amazing. They smell like uh, bread to me, like fresh baked bread, so. I would definitely recommend a Kylochista if you have the patience for it and you're able to water it every day. Um, oh, and another funny thing about this plant is it is leafless. It does not have leaves. It uh, 
conducts photosynthesis with its roots. Um, occasionally it has like a rudimentary leaf that it just puts out if it's not getting enough light, but it drops off really quickly. So this might be my favorite orchid actually. It's pretty awesome. It has sentimental value too. Yeah, but anyways, that those are my orchids that are really like doing something right now. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.